I just thought to myself, why, why are there not any pillows anywhere I go? And then I looked at Dog. And I thought to myself, what do dogs like to do with pillows? Yeah. Yeah, what do dogs like to do with pillows, dog mate? Hmm? Hmm? Uh, do you turn away from me? <laughs> no whining. You've been you've been wrecking all the pillows, haven't you? You naughty boy. Got a doll, baby. I love her so. Nothing else like her anywhere you go. A man, she's anything but calm. Regular pint size atom bomb. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back to Let's Play Fallout 4, where we've got some sweet shades. I can't remember exactly where I picked these up, but uh, they look cool. Don't you think, dog meat? They look great. Anyway, I have decided that I'm going to relocate all of my shit, if I can, uh, to that house down the road there, because... I'm sick of people barging in and, and messing with all my stuff. I'm peckish, apparently. What? Let's fix that. With what exactly? Actually, you know what? Need to do some cooking first, actually. Need to do some cooking because I've got a bunch of meat that needs to be, um, well, cooked. Ribeye steak. Oh, hell yeah. Is that it? Looks like it. Awesome. Alright. Let's have a bit of ribeye steak then. Do, 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 do. Yum. Alright, that should do it. Yeah, properly fed. Excellent. Anyway, so yeah. Um, gonna try and move all of this stuff elsewhere. Um, okay, looks like I can't move the workshop. Let's see, the weapons workbench, the chemistry station, the armor workbench. The power armor station, however, they can all be moved. That is not a problem. So, that's exactly what I'm gonna do, starting with this. Um, I was thinking about taking all my new bits of roofing with me actually to be honest with you but nah, I can't be bothered I'll just make new ones I mean it's pretty easy you know simple stuff to make all I need to do is scrap a few trees and dead cars and we'll we'll be on our way so um actually okay why is it being awkward why is it being weird okay that's that's better it's a little bit in the way of the doorway, but um, yeah, it's not too bad. Move it over a little bit. There we go. That's fine for now, anyway. Let's, oh, suitcases have screws in them. Good to know. All right, yeah. Let's declutterify a lot of this rubbish. Um. So, yeah, let's get the outside sorted first, and then we'll worry about the rest. So, let's go and go back over here, and, uh... You're next. My chemistry station... Ah, speaking of the chemistry station... Uh, in the intervening time between this episode and the last one, I installed a mod... Which will allow us to brew our own alcohol! Finally! So... Happily coinciding with the fact that I just planted a huge amount of potatoes in the back there. Um, we should be able to start making our own vodka and stuff pretty soon. So, uh, looking forward to that. Just need to find some vodka bottles. Um, that's, that's the sticking point as far as the rest of the resources. Well, we need that and we need antiseptic, if you can believe it. <laughs> uh, I hope nobody asks what's in the vodka. Uh... <laughs> they might not like the answer. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. Uh, we need to find some antiseptic. <laughs> I 
don't know if we can make antiseptic, so, uh, yeah. <laughs> but yeah, Sally's particular vodka recipe doesn't apparently include antiseptic, so um, we need that. We need empty vodka bottles and a few other things. So, let's see. Power. Generator small. Okay, so we can make one of those. What about a larger one? <laughs> I don't have enough screws. Damn it. I'll make a small one for now. Um, where to put it, though? They're noisy little buggers, so I kind of want it somewhere where it's not going to keep me up all night, you know what I mean? But also somewhere I can actually feasibly, you know, wire it up to shit. So... <laughs> don't know. I don't know. Just gonna put it out the back here. I don't like the fact that it's floating, though. Put it there. Yeah, but now all the smoke's going everywhere. Still managing to... Yeah, that's... Okay, yeah, Dave, that's not how wind works. <laughs> or, or maybe it is, actually. Whatever, that'll have to do. Um, but it's still floating above the... Right. Alright, close enough. Okay, so we got power. Oh my god, advanced switches, neon signs. Oh, I have to have a look at this. <laughs> oh my days, I can... Oh, this is actually kind of cool. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna have some fun with this, but not right now. Um, miscellaneous recruitment radio beacon, terminal, the light box, alt tech population management system. You what? Pitching machine. Oh, god, I remember those from Fallout 3. Um, je what? Good grief. Oh, fireworks. Okay. A hoop saw. Are you having a laugh? I can make some kind of absolutely ridiculous, like, mousetrap style contraption without, with all this crap, couldn't I? Oh my god. I had no idea what I was missing out on when I played this game the first time around and didn't bother with this. Holy crap. <laughs> there we go. Okay. That's better. Freaking bricks, man. That really annoys me. What do you think, dog meat? What do you think? I don't. I haven't brought your dog bowl in, actually, yet. So apologies for that, but... Uh, on the whole, I think I like it. I think it's good. Sturges, if you come in here and nice start... Job with those defenses. I've got nothing else I need right now. I don't think mean... Preston may want to chat, though. I will push you out the door. Please leave the premises. Thank you. I need a door. I need some- I need a door! I need a door, and one that I can lock as well. Go on, shove off, Sturgis. It's too late at night for this shit. Um... I don't even know what the time is. 8.50pm, well, it's not that late, is it? But, yeah, whatever. In Fallout time, that's pretty late. Alright, wanna be tired, parched. Alright, well... Oh, I need to move my water pump as well. Uh. There we 
we go. Dog meat, I'm going to bed. Alright, well, as you can see, it is a wonderful morning here in the Commonwealth. It's just coming up to six o'clock in the morning, and... Uh, I think the... The universe has decided, no, you shall go back to bed. <laughs> Good God. This is like gas mask weather, this is. This is really something. Good grief. It's quite, quite unpleasant indeed. Um, I don't know how I'm going to structure these episodes out, to be honest with you. I'm either going to have had to cut out quite a bit of faffing there with the settlement building. Uh, which I probably will have done, to be honest with you. Either that, or I, I will have to make that as a whole separate little video or something. Because 50 odd minutes of, of me moving furniture around, I, that's probably a bit much for most people's sanity, so... <laughs> I might have, uh, might have had to cut that down quite significantly. This room bothers me. Never mind. Good grief. Yeah, it's still, um... We need to take some rad away. It's kind of getting to that point right now. Uh, where's my rad away? There you are. I'm apparently hungry. Deathclaw steak. Uh, in that case, and I'll put the gas mask on because apparently we want to uh, avoid the radiation. Are we? I was gonna say, are we, are we, we're in the sunglasses and the gas mask at the same time, but no, it's just a bit of a weird texture thing. Yeah. There we go. I was trained in the zone, dog mate. This is nothing. You ever seen a blowout? Nah. You haven't. Is much scarier than this. Anyway. Did I take the core out of the back of this thing? Yeah, I did. Good. 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 Well, let's see. Spit. Don't even know. Purified water, vodka bottles, and potatoes. That I can do, the purified water and the potatoes, that's fine. It's just. Finding an empty water bottle. Oh, it's a problem. Although, I've just noticed I need. Uh, we need a rank of party girl slash boy as well, apparently, in order for this to work well. <sighs> the lengths we must go to acquire a supply of alcohol, dog meat. It is quite ridiculous, my friend. Oh well. Any weapons tinkering I can do. Well, I think we're mostly catered for, aren't we? Other than maybe messing around with the shotgun a bit. I can't really do much there because I don't have any nuclear materials, so... Mm. Need screws. That's the main thing. Need screws. Break. <laughs> Exceptional recoil control. And we need two ranks in gun nut for that to work, so forget it. Right, I think we're good. Yes, indeed. I think it's. Oh, it looks like it's clearing up. Stupid noisy generator. Well, it's alright, isn't it? We could do worse, I suppose. It's a house. It's a home of a sort. I don't know what to do with this room here. I'll think of something. Um, 
But yes, I need to go get a mod or something that will allow me to uh, tidy up things like leaves and random bricks on the ground and things like that, because uh, this is just unacceptable, all of this. I get that after a nuclear disaster, generally people tend to care a lot less about mess. Um, so there's some interesting studies done about that, actually, about survivors of Hiroshima and Nagasaki. They found that actually, in addition to all the other traumatic stuff, um, survivors of the event tended to really stop caring about tidiness and, um, you know, clean surroundings and things like that. They kind of just got used to the squalor and wreckage, essentially. Which would explain why a lot... Uh, why a lot um, of this has not been cleared up in the last 200 years. People have just got sort of gotten used to the mess and they feel a bit weird if there aren't a bunch of random bricks and dead leaves lying around. Could explain that. Could explain that, dog meat. We never know. Anyway. The main thing is we've got a bed, we've got all our crafting stuff, and we've got a ceiling that hopefully will not leak when it rains. I'm um, actually quite pleased with that. It's got, it sort of worked out a lot, much, a lot better this time than it did the first time. It's gone rather well. In before it still leaks anyway. <laughs> uh, we'll find out. Well, anyway. So, let's get this horrible gas mask off. Um, put on our cool sunglasses with the extra perception. Um even though it's not even that bright out. Gives us what plus one perception anyway, apparently. Uh, right, so what's on today's agenda then? Well, I think for one thing, it might be a good idea to uh, make a lot of holotapes and settings things that I could grief. It might be a good idea to ditch some of this stuff actually. So that all takes up quite a bit of weight altogether, doesn't it? Um, what else? Got a couple of fusion cores. I only need one for now, though. This is all fine. I think we're good. We've got a lot of, like, food and stuff with us, I suppose, but we might need that, you know, so I think I'll, um, stick with it for now, although I really need that right now. I don't know what the hell the soft shell mile oak meat's for, because it's, I can't, I don't seem to be able to cook it or anything, so um alright, cool about our primary needs and stuff Suppressed immunity, increased chance of getting sick. Ech. If I can take that will uh, mitigate that a bit. Doesn't really look like it. Oh well. Alright, so one more thing. I would like to have my water pump back. Well, one of the water pumps, anyway. I mean, you guys have got that one over there now, so. I want this one. If possible. Yeah, put it right there. Lovely. Which means we can fill up our water bottles and stuff. Which is definitely a thing we want to do. For sure. Out all of it. Yeah, it looks like it. And so we can get a drink while we're here. Very good. All right then. So let's see. We want to go fetch Codsworth before we go as well. That's the other thing to remember. But um, where do we want to go? 
where do we want to go? We could poke around Concord, but I think we've kind of seen everything there is to see there, so... There's the thicket excavations. We could bring our power armor over there and do a bit of scuba diving, essentially. <laughs> Not sure I really fancy doing that right now, though. There's Ten Pines Bluff, and yeah, there's the Corvega Assembly Plant. Maybe we should start reaching a bit further south then. I'll we'll kind of head out the, around this way and meander our way down there and see what we find along the way. I think uh, we've got fair old bit of ammunition to be getting on with. Seems good to me. So I say let's let's go. Where's Codsworth? Codsworth! God, this looks a bit bare now, doesn't it, with all my stuff removed. <laughs> I think I might take back some of these candles, actually, but yeah, we'll deal with that later. Um, where is Codsworth? Codsworth! Are any of these grown yet? I'd be surprised, but yeah, no, not yet. Ah, but when they have grown, we shall make many, many bottles of vodka. Um, yeah. Have you seen Codsworth? Is he in here somewhere? D -d -d Dog, out of the way. Now, I have a mod that will allow me, in theory, to take dog meat with me. In addition to Codsworth. We're about to find out whether or not it'll work, I suppose. Yeah, this place is a bit of a tip and all. It's just leaves everywhere. Oh, they're, they're, this place has got lots of extra rooms. Like, a, a bit like this is kind of better in a way, but it doesn't have that big old driveway where I can put all my um, crafting benches and stuff, though, so. Where is that robot? For heaven's sake. You'll find what you're looking for. There he for. is. I know it. Codsworth. Shall I accompany you, ma'am? Yeah. Yes, of course. Lead the way, ma'am. No, it's fine, dog mate. You can come anyway. Not to worry there, pup. Your mistress is in good hands. Yeah, I think it'll still play this. City will be like. The name has anything to do with it. It must be quite nice. Very good. Um... Yeah, he should still be coming with us. It's just, it will, it will, yeah. It will still play the dialogue anyway. Brilliant! Okay, right. Hopefully having both of you around isn't going to get in the way too much, but uh, only one way to find out, so. Alright. Let's get the heck out of here. I really do wish I had a backpack. Actually, before we go, you can make a backpack workbench thing, can't you? I just want to find out what I need for it. Oh my word! Um, backpack wedge bench, wood, screws, leather, steel, and rank one in armor. Okay, well, good to know. Let us be on our way, then. And keep an eye out for leather. Lead, and let you know what, I'm going to add that to the, to, to the list. I am. Uh, somehow. Uh. Where is it? There we go. Stuff what is important. Leather. Did that save? Yeah, it did. Awesome. Okay. Right. I wonder if I can get a computer terminal. Actually, that'd be a pretty cool thing to have. I could plop it right on the desk in my back room. Can you craft a computer terminal? Maybe not. I don't know. But then it, can I move a computer terminal, though? Can I, because there's a bunch of them in these houses, can I just grab one and take that? Well, we'll find out when we get back, I suppose.
Off we go. Got anything to say, Codsworth? Hey. Something you need, Mum? What is it, Mum? Your thoughts? A blind man walks into a bar. And a table. <laughs> and a chair. Okay. That was all I had. All right, then. Whoever it was that programmed all the Mr. Handys with just an unlimited supply of dad jokes, shame on you. <laughs> all right, well, it's a beautiful morning now that the horrible radiation storm has buggered off. That was not so nice. So, yeah. I guess the Corvega factory is our primary go-to point, for, for lack of a different one. And we'll just sort of loot and scavenge our, our, our way along as we head through, I guess. Since we don't really know what's out there beyond Concord that much. So we get further south, and uh, yeah, one of these days we need to get to Diamond City, so... um. You know what, I should probably start collecting plants and things, because I could make, like, you know, medicine with them and stuff, presumably. I know I keep saying it, but I do like this grass mod, it's pretty cool. It gives a whole kind of Last of Us look to all of this, actually. I haven't played that game in ages, I do have it on my PS4, but my PS4 is not plugged in. and hasn't been for quite some time, so... It's been a while since I played that game. It's bloody good, though. There's quite a few games, actually. I kind of wish I had a capture card set up or something. So that I could uh, record them or stream them. But, uh... What the... But Jesus. But, um... I can't afford that kind of shit at the moment, so... As Darth Vader once said... Impressive. Most impressive. Um, hello. So what's your story? Looking to trade? Rob me? Or just ask directions to Diamond City? Your money, all of it, now. Diamond City? Where's that? Directions. Hmm, figures. Just keep going until you see the skyline. Cross the river. You'll find the Great Green Jewel. Just inside the city limits. Never seen an albino one before. Definitely something worth mounting. What the? Who are you and what's going on? Are you okay? What the? Are you a trader? Can I buy things off you? Hey, Carla. You again. Here to trade? What kind of stuff do you have? Just a bit of everything. You'd be surprised what people leave behind on the old roads. Gotta keep your eyes peeled for um. good stuff. Huh? Come on and fight you. Yeah. Look at these trace arounds. It's kind of cool. This site is useless though, isn't it? Bloody hell. Yeah, this is not a close up and personal weapon at all. Carla! Oh, right, now we. Carla! Back again? Yes. Time to do business? Yes. Let's see what you have. Always happy to make a sale. Oh my god, what is going on with this Brahmin right now? <laughs> Ooh, bobby pins. There we go. 40, 4570 hunting rifle. Ooh. I'll try it. No, I don't really have any ammo for that, but uh, cool. Oh my word! Look at that. That's a crossbow. Holy crap! It's not cheap though. Woo! Goodness me! Leather chest piece, curious. Oh, I could do with one of those actually. I'll have one of those pipe shotgun. Powerful bayoneted. Oh, you've got some ammo. Lead! Yes, please. 
Uh, Braxoclean acid, antiseptic, fiber. Yes. Arm clock, nuclear material. Yes. Um. Oil. Oh yes. Okay. Well, how much is that? That's awesome. Batting helmet, beer, binoculars, battery, biometric scanner. Yeah. All right. Cooking oil. Yeah, sure. Crystal liquor decanter. It's got, oh, it's got crystals. Um, I believe I might need that for something. <laughs> you can say that of literally anything here, though. I just, I remember seeing something I wanted a while ago and it had crystals as one of the requirements. That's what I'm thinking. <laughs> Dear me. Flare, frag grenades, frag mines, fusion core. Look up failed. That's always good, but it looks like there's shipments of steel and wood and things like that, so that's okay. Um, still haven't fixed that. Um, microscope. Bloody hell, that's got some good stuff in it. Military ammo bag. Can I wear one of those? Like, will that increase... Ooh. I'm going to take that. Like, I'm, I'm wondering if that's a wearable type thing, you know. Shipment of asbestos. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, for some reason I found that really amusing. Um, bloody hell, that's expensive. Okay. Um, surveyor outfit. Vodka! Thank you very much. Wrapped cap, combat knife, knuckle switchblade. Doodly doodly doo. You've got some good stuff here, Carla. You've got some good shit in here, I have to admit. All right, I'll give you all of that, actually, I guess. Um, and what do I... Yeah, okay. Thanks for saying... world, eh? Um, what? Excuse me. Yes? You were going to say something and then you were interrupted? Huh? Um... This is all a bit weird. Where's that guy buggered off to? The one talking about albino something or others. What are you... Huh? Are you following me? Come again. Yeah? Codsworth, why is this farmer following me? Well, moving on. God, this has all gone a bit weird. I'm pretty sure. Ugh, are you kidding me? I thought this was a different type of leather chest. It's literally just the same, isn't it? I have. Thoroughly wasted a bunch of money, that. Well done. Mind. What are you doing? Huh? Go away. Hey. Huh? 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 Yeah. Huh? I'm actually gonna have to kill you, aren't I? Because you're going to blow my cover, and if you're too stupid not to we leave. Had a deal, Trudy. Hand over the goods you owe us. I ain't giving you poison shilling chem pushers anything. Do you know what that junk has done to my boy? He bought them fair and square, Trudy. Huh? Ain't our fault if he's struck. Seriously, out. dude. Now don't make me come in there and shoot up that little trading post of yours. Whoa, whoa. Easy there, scammer. This doesn't involve you. <laughs> I'm not in the mood. I'm calling it right here. This world can officially bite my ass. Hey, we all got problems, all right? I'm just trying to collect on what's owed to me. Don't suppose you feel like helping us out. You could use an extra gun, or maybe you talk some sense into Trudy over there. 
Who's Trudy? See that diner right in front of us? Trudy owns the place. She's converted it into a small shop. I sell her chems, she gives me caps and parts I need. And when her son Patrick had his 18th birthday, I might have sold him some jet. Then some more. Then a lot more. Now he's in debt. Mm-hmm. Looks to me like they shouldn't have bought that jet and you shouldn't have sold it to them. Yeah, well, hindsight's a bitch. And I'm holding the leash. Now you gonna help us out or what? And why would I help you exactly? Look, I deal in chems. You know, medicine. Kind of useful out in these parts. Stim packs can patch up your wounds in seconds. Not to mention all the fun stuff. I got that too. You help me out and we can do business. Trust me, I'm a good friend to have. Hmm. Kind of don't want to get involved, really. But, uh... I'll talk to her. Maybe we can work this out. I appreciate it. If things go sideways, we'll back you up. Trudy, I presume. Hi. I saw you in that poison cellar talking. Well, he ain't getting his money. Period. Hmm. I want to help you, Trudy. What can I do? Get rid of Wolfgang. I don't know what he offered you, but I'll pay you a hundred caps to kill that jet-selling scumbag. Uh, he is kind of a scumbag, that's for sure. Wolfgang and I had a deal. If I'm gonna back out on it, I'll need more, okay? I'll make it 125 caps. Well, that'll reimburse me a bit for the bloody, uh, cock up with the leather cuirass, I suppose. Um. Uh, can I really fleece her for any more? Fuck it, I'm not a charity. Come on. Don't make me think twice about this. I'll pay you 150 caps then. All right, Trudy. I'll get rid of him. Thank you. I'll back you up from here. Go get him. Yeah. Oh, bloody hell. Let's do this. Job done. Excuse me. <laughs> I can't wait to see the crows feeding on that scumbag. Here, this is for you. Now, if you ever need to trade, my shop's open. You got things covered from here? Yeah. It's gonna take my son a while to get off the chems, but we'll make it. We always do. Now, let's get back to business. You need anything for the road? Mm, yep. I've got a few minutes to browse. It's all worth every cap I'm charging. Let's see. More bobby pins, please. And I want to sell you this useless piece of crap. <laughs> um... 45 submachine gun. Oh my, that's actually really, really cool. <laughs> I kind of want that. Um, crossbow short, quick eject. Hmm. Suppressed. Oh, hello. That's interesting. It's almost worth buying just to get the, bit, the suppressor off it, but it's kind of expensive, so forget it. Uh, let's see. Is there really anything here I want? Not especially that I can see right now. <laughs> There's the desk fans, I suppose. Uh, you find them all over the place, though. Good old lookup failed. I 
Tank shift battery. Oh yeah, I'll have that for sure. Um, General Chow's Revenge. Holy shit! Look at that. That is expensive as shit, but that is pretty cool. I'm gonna have to remember you've got that. <laughs> My god. That's uh, pretty cool. Oh, and machete as well. Mm. Do, 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 do. Actually, uh, machete is actually sort of actually kind of appealing. Actually, to be fair. I think I'll take one. Uh, I tell you what, I'll give you the, the baton in return. There you go. Um, Alright, that'll do. Yes, yes, as a matter of fact, we are Codsworth. Now, if I could just... This dude here really needs to go take a hike. This is getting ridiculous. Right. Never take a hit of Jad again, I swear. Good. Hey. Huh? <sighs> I, whatever. Metal right arm band brace. Yeah? Yes. What's that about? Also, what about the um Ah uh, yeah, no, I don't think I can wear the uh the army ammo pouch. I wondered if it was part of the backpack mod I've got, you see, so that's why I bought it. Um Metal Van Brace. Hmm. I mean it's a little bit heavier. Definite improvement in terms of damage resistance, though, so I guess I'll, uh, guess I'll take it. Um, Trudy, can I just sell you this back, please? Quickly, my, you know, leather, what you call it, bracer thing. You guys have a skeleton in here? Could you not, like, clean up? For heaven's huh? sake. I can rest easy knowing that Wolfgang is rotten in hell. Thank you. Do you need anything? Yes, actually. Um, Let's see what you got. All salvaged, but nothing's junk. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, you can have that. Four caps. That wasn't even worth the effort. Miss Sally, how can I be of assistance? You can follow me, but do try and keep a little bit out of the way, unlike this idiot. Thank you. Right. Let's assign you to three. Uh, a big ass machete now. Could prove useful. I'd like to upgrade it and stuff as well, but. I don't know. Nice bike. Alright, so. Moving on. Where the hell are we going? South somewhere, aren't we? Supposed to be anyway. Yeah, down to the Corvega factory, which is this way somewhere. Let us continue onwards, then. After this weird little detour. Everything about this trip so far has been a little bit strange. Where's the farmer? Oh, for God. Dude, I yes. really don't want to kill you, but if you continue following me around and annoying me like this, I am actually going to have to dump your body in a ditch somewhere. Believe me, not above doing that. Seriously not above murder. wasn't above murder huh? before this, the, 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 all this happened in the first place to be fair so I'll have that though what do we have here Um, hello. Who are you? Hi there. Hi, miss. Yes. Thought that was him talking there for a second. Dad. Hi. Can yeah? we leave a light on tonight? I like sleeping with the light on. Sure thing, baby. I'll watch over you while you sleep. 
Hey, pal. Huh? <clears throat> huh? Why are all the NPCs in this game acting so weird? Oh my god. Why does he have Daddy, a sack hood like with hoses? Charlie, you're beautiful. Just like a princess. Oh, I don't know. Everything's a bit strange today. Started off with a radiation storm and it got it went downhill from there. My goodness. Tight. Yeah, we're not getting in there anytime soon, are we? Um Yeah. Just straight up weird. Oh, we can level up. Let's do that. Uh so. Where's the one that allows us to brew? <laughs> Politician. People are easier to persuade. Oh, that'll be why we didn't. We, we weren't doing so well with those speech checks in spite of having such high charisma because there's a perk for that now. Okay. Fair enough. I do want. I do need a, a rank in blacksmith at some point. But I'm. I want. I want my vodka more. So. <laughs> if I can get it. Um. Where is it on here? Would it be in the charisma section? Probably. There we, no, that's not it. Uh, better not be like a super duper high level perk for some stupid reason. Oh, there it is. Party girl. Endurance 5 we need for that, apparently. Really? Ugh. Uh. Uh, well, we're going to start somewhere, I guess. Besides, our endurance is hilariously low at the minute. Could have done with an upgrade anyway. All right, fair enough. Uh, got a bit more health now, then. On the bright side. If that's what it takes to get my hands on booze, that that is exactly what we're going to have to do. Oh, hello. Are you sure there isn't someone more suited to all this? Do you have any second thoughts, Codsworth? Right. Don't know how sneaking around is going to go with this bunch following me around, but... I am going to switch to the crossbow anyway. If I can. What the heck? Okay, that was a bit weird. Door that cannot be opened. And a terminal that is locked. Are you? Is this a joke? Because it's not very funny. Sod it then. Are you? Where did this come from? Codsworth, did we just step through some sort of time portal? What the hell's going on? Got a doll, baby. I love her so. Nothing else like her anywhere you go. A man, she's anything but calm. A regular pint size atom bomb. Atom bomb, baby. Atom bomb. I want her in my wigwam. She's just the way I want it to be. A million times hotter than.